today I'm gonna show you guys one way that new developers use to blow up their games on Roblox. And that is Social Seed. I've told you guys before, advertising from YouTubers is one of the best ways to get instant players to your Roblox games. However, the main kickback I get is bro, none of these YouTubers respond to me and none of them check their DMs. So how do we actually contact them? Guys, that is one thing that Social Seed is fantastic at. First thing we're gonna do is sign up and then we're gonna show you guys how this works. Now, I'm already a member of Social Seed on the content creator side and I have been for months. So I had to start a brand new account just to sign up and show you guys how it works. So all you're gonna wanna do is click the first link in the description, click join Social Seed, and then click what you are. I'm assuming you're a developer. So you're gonna click right here and this will lead you to the Social Seed group. You'll simply join the group and that puts you into the request to join. And then you're gonna copy your profile link from Roblox. Paste that right in right here and click verify. Pops up with your Roblox account and I have read and accept the terms of service and privacy policy. Of course, read these at your own discretion. Uh, make sure you're understanding what you're joining in on. But your boy never reads them. I'll probably get in trouble someday for that. Anyways, then we can continue with Google or an email address. I'm gonna use an email address. And boom, just like that, once you type in an email address and a password, you now have an account. And welcome to Social Seed. Guys, this place is pretty sick. So on this first page, we see a bunch of YouTubers. You can see their average views as well as the rate they charge per video. Of course, the more views they get, the more they're going to charge. So $1,750 is way out of budget for a lot of new developers. But we can sort this. We can select what platform and what we want them to do. So let's say we want a full YouTube video on our game ASAP. Boom, deselect all of those. And this is just YouTube videos. And it pops up with a bunch of creators. Now we can select about how many views we want this video to get. Let's drag this down because our budget's not quite as high as some of these more popular developers that also use this site. Let's say we want it to get like 140,000 views. That's pretty respectable. And I wouldn't really say subscriber count matters because it doesn't matter if they have 5 million subscribers. We need to base this off of the view counts. We can select gender and our target age range as well. We can also select what language and what country. But with our parameters set, we can now look at these YouTubers, find one that fits our budget. P.S. When the dream game comes out, I'm definitely using this site. I'm gonna pay so many different people, which will help them out and it'll help out the dream game. But this one is crazy. Two day delivery, unlimited revisions, $15 a video. This is their average views. This is their subscribers. Now guys, before you make the offers for these guys to make a video on your game, definitely check out their channel. Right here it says they have 34,000 average views, but 300 subscribers. So let's go check out their latest video and their channel to see what we're paying for before we pay for it. All right, so it seems they've only ever uploaded one YouTube video and it doesn't look like it's even on Roblox, this is some sort of a Subway Surfers game. So personally, I would shy away. Let's go back to all the creators and find one that we would actually want to work with. I would recommend looking at their channel and making sure they upload videos on your game genre. If they're a simulator YouTuber, don't send them a tycoon game because most of their fan base is probably only interested in simulators anyways. Let's see what this guy does. More techie. $800 for him to make a video, but he averages 250,000 views. Almost 100,000 subscribers and it seems he is on the simulator wave. So if you had a simulator, you could definitely hire this guy. Two day delivery, link in bio and unlimited revisions. All in all guys, Social Seed is a website that really lets developers contact YouTubers directly instead of having to fight the flood of DMs YouTubers get daily. And the budgets are all over the place. If you got big bills like a platypus, you could hire some of these top creators. If you're starting a bit lower, it still isn't a bad thing. Let's say, let's say we're gonna start lower around here and let's turn the subscriber counts down as well. What happens is a chain reaction. Once a few of these YouTubers start making a video on your game, even if one of those videos blows up, 
other YouTubers will see it and be like, yo, that's a new sick game. I should make a video too. So just hiring one or two of these YouTubers, you could end up getting a bunch of them for free. I do think this is just a really cool site where you can get direct contact with popular YouTubers instead of having to fight the thousands of DMs they're getting daily asking people to play their game. Of course, you can still go into that sea of DMs and try to get a video made for free, but this is more of a guaranteed option. Right here, we have one Cole, 180,000 average views, three to $400, I'm gonna hire him. Let's make an offer, and here's the steps. Select a game or add a UGC item. I'm gonna add a game. We need to copy our game's URL. Oh my gosh, light mode hurts. Anyways, let's take our dream game testing place. We're gonna paste that right in, click next, and click save. So now we have our game on the platform. We can also create a listing. What this is gonna do is let the YouTubers see it and come to us instead of us having to go to them. You need a short description. I'm gonna say looking for creators to check out my game on a video. Then we can say what type of platforms we're accepting. I personally think all of them are A-OK. -okay. And then we set our budget for each person. So let's say on YouTube, we have a $50 budget. And let's say we want them to pull 50,000 views. There we go. And then we would do the same for shorts and TikTok. Then we click create. And now we have created a listing on Social Seed. If we go over to game listings, we can see all the other games who have created listings. So this page in the developer side of things is just for us to view. We can see what other people are doing. Now I'm gonna switch to my YouTuber account so you guys could see how it would look for the YouTuber. So from the YouTuber side, if we go ahead and click on one of these listings, we can click apply. If our YouTube channel meets the requirements they have, as you can see, we can click apply here. And on these ones, it says requirements not met because we don't do shorts. We don't do TikTok and we don't do fresh cut. However, on YouTube, we can apply. And then we can include a message in this application to make this game developer choose us over a different YouTuber who's also applying for this gig. We can also try the game before we want to apply for it as well. So all in all, this is a site that really helps YouTubers and developers connect. It helps the YouTuber earn a little bit of extra money and helps the developer get direct access to that YouTuber's site, I guess. It's a lot easier for me to see a message on this getting maybe one or two messages a week rather than thousands a day on Discord. So if you guys want to check out Social Seed, check out that first link in the description and let me know what you guys think of the site. That will wrap it up today. If you're a YouTuber, you'll definitely see some Dream Game listings pretty soon on the website. So hit your boys game listings up, all right? And if you're a developer and you want myself or any of these other YouTubers to make a video on your game, check out Social Seed. That is going to wrap it up for today. If you did enjoy and want to see more content like this, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a great day. Later.